Thank you. Good, after, good morning, Governor. Uh, my question has to do with uh, your understanding of states' rights in the 10th Amendment. Um, last year, 44% of voters in Nevada voted to end marijuana prohibition in their state, not just for medical use, but the whole failed policy. If you become president and a state chooses to end its prohibition of marijuana during your term, how will you respond? Uh, I believe that marijuana should be illegal in our country. It is the pathway to drug usage. Um, uh, by our society, which is a great scourge, which is one of the great causes of crime in our cities. And, th and I believe that, that we are uh, in, in a state where, of course, we are very concerned about people who are suffering pain. And there are very, uh, uh, various means of providing pain management. And, uh, and those that have had loved ones that have gone through an a, a end of life with cancer know the nature of real pain. I've watched my wife's mom and dad, both in our home, were going through cancer treatment, suffering a great deal of pain. But they didn't have marijuana, and they didn't need marijuana because there were other sources of pain management that worked entirely effectively. I'm told there's even a synthetic marijuana as well that's available. But having, but having legalized marijuana is, in my view, an effort by a, 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 very, a very committed few to try and get marijuana out of the public and to ultimately legalize marijuana. It's a long way to go. We need less drugs in this society. Uh, not more drugs, and I would oppose the legalization of marijuana in the country or legalization of marijuana for medicinal purposes because pain management is available from other sources. Thank you. Uh, let's see, I guess it's my turn to choose it. Go ahead, this time later right here. Yeah.